you, the elephant in the room, I guess, is this magical box over here. Fine. And yet again, a PH neutral product. But I promise I did help. It's not the truth. <laughs> What's going on guys? Welcome back to SAB TV and welcome to another video. You'll realize I'm here with James from a Bath Detail in UK and we've come to James's house. And the reason I'm here is because James has seen the previous video that I released, which is pretty much me cleaning my car. Um, and I have hardly any detail experience whatsoever. Uh, and I think James is in a better position who's had a lot more exposure to detail products, if you like, uh, to give me a bit more of an understanding as to what's best to use on the car, how best to apply it, and just in general, what are the best methods of cleaning your car? So. We're here today and we're gonna do a little bit of a clean of my car, I'm probably gonna do James's as well. Might yeah, as well do yours yeah, as well. Might as well yeah. We've got both yeah. cars here. Um, and we're gonna showcase some of the new Valet Pro products. Yeah. Do you wanna give us a bit of insight on them? Um, so we've got a little deal going with Valet Pro at the moment. Uh, big shout out to Mark and Greg uh, for sort of working with us. Uh, we've got a nice range of products that we've got, you know, we can use. Uh, courtesy yeah. of them, free of charge. So yeah, we're gonna try and show you today what they're capable of. Happy days. So we're going to try out a load of the Valley Pro products. I'm going to start the video off by giving you guys some nice time lapses, some sexy shots of car cleaning. And then towards the end, me and James will sit down and we'll talk through the methods and how we did it and how best to apply them to your car. And guys, if you haven't already, head over to AD UK, Bath Detail UK. I'll leave a link to the Facebook page down in the description. And also thank you all so much. You guys have been killing it on the Team SAB TV shop. You can grab yourself some of these and some stickers as well. And again, all the links in the description below. But for now, let's start cleaning cars. Right guys, so we are now done with my car. We're gonna sit down and run you through exactly kind of the process that we went through to get the car looking as she is, because she's looking very, very clean. And a massive thank you to James for really helping me out today. I really appreciate it. Right guys, so we are now chilling. As you can probably tell from all of the past shots to this point, it has been a pretty laborious task. And I know it looks like James has done pretty much all of the stuff on my car, but I promise I did help. It's not the truth. <laughs> Yeah, 
Yeah, so pretty much I was holding the camera and James doing a lot of the car. But a huge thank you, mate, to yourself for helping me out cleaning the car. That's all right. And I think the first thing that we need to quickly touch on is you, the elephant in the room, I guess, is this magical box over here. And this is a box, a box of products with, which is stocked up with Valet Pro, isn't it, not James? Correct, yeah. And James will be selling these boxes on the ADUK uh, Facebook pages. So if you want one of these bad boys, head over to the ADUK Facebook, and I guess I'll hand over to James to tell us what's in the box. So we've got uh, a nice wooden crate here, which is made by Steve Edit, one of our members on our page. Um, they're all handmade. They're well made, solid products for your boot of your car. You know, if you're going to a show, it's perfect, you know, crate to put your products in. Um, so within the crate, you've got yourself six Mark fiber towels, foam applicator, 500 ml of glass cleaner, 500 milliliters of their bug remover, 500 ml of their dragon's breath, 500 ml of their shampoo with dash brush, pot of their beady marvelous wax, that's the future, which is a tire and trim dresser. So how much are they going for? So for the box and everything inside, uh, so we're talking 50 quid worth of products, uh, the retail price of them is £45 without delivery or we can do it for £53 delivered which is DPD next day delivery uh, which is pretty much a bargain if you ask me. That is good going and for obviously everything up until this point so we've used pretty much all of those products yep. on my car. We haven't done James's yet but we've done mine so I think one of the questions that came out from my last video and it wasn't a full on detail um, it was pretty much a basic watch that watch a wash and James saw that video as well and a lot of you guys ping me messages on Instagram around you know what's the best method to wash the car you know what's the process used can you give me a bit more detail around the products used so I think we'll probably touch on now I guess from the start to the end of the process of what we did in terms of cleaning the car so today we've obviously used a lot of the products which can be found in this box which you can purchase from my Facebook page so the first product we used was the Valet Pro bug remover, which is a full size item which comes in the box. And we pretty much applied this and then left it on for how long? Say? Uh, we left it for five, five, six minutes. It's a pH neutral uh, formula and it's also wax and LSP safe, perfect for your car. Any sort of finish, if you, even if you wax, you know, seal them, it's perfectly fine. Um, it's obviously just a simple spray head, easy to spray on, you know, leave it for a bit and then, you know, straight pressure wash bang off what's obviously me being a relatively a relative novice to detailing so what what are the risks of using a non ph balanced bug remover or, or so say if you sort of you know you don't use a bug remover and use something like a traffic film remover if it's you know highly acidic um, it can remove you know your wax your polish your sealant from the paint uh, leaving you obviously just bare paint again so obviously all the hard work you've put in has been ruined. It can also, you know, if you use a TFR on the dry on surface, it can also stain, um, and then you're gonna have to put even more effort in to get it off. And am I right in saying that, okay, I guess all of the Valet Pro products are made to work with each other? Yeah, correct. And, and so after we did the bug remover, we then moved on to, we moved on to wheels, didn't we? Oh, uh, we did snow foam. Snow foam, sorry, snow foam. We really like the snow foam. Neither of us had tried the snow foam before, and the thing that we all talk about amongst the community, I guess, when it comes to snow, snow foam, is you want that really thick snow. Um, the Auto Bright stuff that I used in my previous video was not thick at all, but this stuff was ridiculous. Yeah. The thing is, you can get some sort of snow foams that are too thick, as we call them, Instagram foam, um, <laughs> just for the show. And you know, they don't do much. They sit on the surface. They'll do their little bit. They won't. They won't clean the surface of the dirt and contaminants which are there. Uh, this pH neutral snow foam, and yet again, a pH neutral product. Uh, we put 300 ml into a lance and we filled up with 600 millilitres of water, so just under a litre. Uh, and the foam was ridiculous, as you'll see in some of the shots. And the cleaning power is really good. It's a thick foam, but it works. We went on to wheels. Obviously, you know, we washed the wheels down first. Sam's Sticky Wheel Cleaner, which is a just a generic sort of wheel shampoo. Um, you can dilute it one to 10 in the spray bottle and this one litre will cost you around five pounds. And then we hit it with uh, Dragon's Breath, which is also pH balanced again, which is an iron fallout remover. Safe for all paint surfaces and all types of wheels. And it gives that really cool yeah. bleeding effect as well. It literally yeah. looks like your wheels are just bleeding. Yeah. So this comes in a 500 mil bottle again. Most of their stuff's in 500 mil. For the value of the product, I think it's really good. It's a gel sort of consistency. So it's much more of a sort of, it sticks on the surface and it's just run off. You can get some of these cheap ones off eBay and they just sort of run off the surface and you know they don't do what they're meant to do. Was it Dragon's Breath? Dragon's Breath. The, right. na the name alone yeah. just makes me happy. I love a bit of Dragon's Breath. Awesome. And then 
after we cut the wheels, we did the snow foam, we did the bug remover, the car was ready for washing. Ready. Yeah, ready for washing. We used the Advanced Poseidon Car Wash. Powerful yet gentle shampoo. We highly rate this product. A lot of my close friends also rate this product as well. And then after we did all of that, so we washed the car, we dried it. It looks absolutely stunning. As you can probably see in the background. Now the sun's out, it really is popping. The black is looking awesome for probably all of 10 minutes because as you know, with black cars, they just get filthy instantly. But to finish the car off, we used Black to the Future, was it? Yep, so we got Black to the Future. You get a sample pot in here, which will probably give you, you know, three or four uses. Um, we used it on the trim on the outside. We did. It was slightly sort of faded, had a few little speckles on it. I mean, we brought back the shine to it. You know, it was just lacking that sort of colour that it should have. Um, and we also use this on the tyres. And obviously guys, the last thing that comes in the Valet Pro ADUK box is the Beating Marvelous Wax. Uh, we didn't have any time to use it today and in fact we didn't really need to use it because the car already has a layer of super resin and um, Autoglim HD wax on it already. But stay tuned because potentially in the future when I need to re-wax, it's probably worth we give this a go. Yeah, correct. And we've also got Jack, one of James's friends who has got the BMW, which I'm overlaying now, the one series. And Jack brought down his DAS 6 Pro polishing machine. And obviously we didn't use it, we didn't need to. But if we do need to make a video about waxing the, uh, polishing the car, we'll bring Jack along and we will do that on my car. So guys, I think that's gonna be pretty much the end of the video. Make sure you head over to a Bath Detail UK's YouTube channel, just started as well. So giving him a free plug here. Yeah. I'll leave the link to his channel in the description. And you may find some other videos from today over on James's channel. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video guys. If you have, please like, share and subscribe. And of course, I'll see you all on the next one. Thank you, bye bye.